It's over. You're breaking up with me over text? I'm too lazy to do it in person. You just weren't special enough for me. Like, you know, like I can't be bothered. We live together, Susie. You could literally just walk upstairs. That is some next level lazy. Like you live with this dude and you can't even go up the stairs to break up with him. She's like, why don't you come downstairs instead? You're the one breaking up with him. He's like, you're unbelievable. I think he should be glad that she's breaking up with him because this is all sorts of types of crazy. Baby, let's take our relationship to the next level. What did you have in mind, sweetie? Let me access all of your social media. <laughs> I was thinking we can also have a joint Facebook account. It's gonna be so cute. You're never gonna get any privacy ever again. We could also have a joint phone, joint account. At this rate, we might as well just hank off each other forever. You don't even get privacy to take a poop. Mwah. Babe, want to cuddle and watch Netflix tonight? Sure, let me tell my friends. I'll hang out with them tomorrow. Guys, my dumb boyfriend wants to hang out tonight. We'll go clubbing tomorrow night. How do you not realize you're messaging the same person? And how are you gonna act so excited to him, but then message your friends and be like, he's so dumb, I hate him, ah! I mean, if you really wanted to go with your friends, you could've just told him. You didn't need to, like, do this. Babe, I'm going through your stuff. Who is Carol? Carol's my cousin. Oh, in that case, I'm not going through your stuff. I was joking. It's a really good joke, right? Ah, jokes. My ex-boyfriend is renting out our spare bedroom. Don't you think that's a little inappropriate? I do think that's a little inappropriate. I agree with the boyfriend here. Like, he's gonna have to put up with you living with your ex-boyfriend. Like, somebody who you had an intimate romantic relationship with. And now he's, like, probably gonna be low-key terrified to go to work or go do anything because he's like, what's going on with my girlfriend and her ex-boyfriend? This is so weird on so many levels how do you do this rachel anyways let's see rachel's response she goes i need to make money somehow you couldn't find anybody else to rent it out to you couldn't find any other way to make money i can i can name a million ways that you could have be better ways okay, i'm not even gonna bother rachel clearly clearly you don't get it sorry for tonight but i have my principles you made a scene because they ran out of chocolate cake for dessert what kind of place runs out of dessert? I'm on Valerie's side for this one, okay? Imagine you go somewhere and all you want is your sweet, 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 delicious chocolate cake and they don't got it. I mean, I'm not about to throw a scene, but maybe like, uh, I'm allowed to be a little disappointed on, on the inside, right? But like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna throw a scene because you know, just shit happens. Hey babe, I can't hang out tonight. I'm feeling sick. Aw, oh, feel better, baby. I'll bring you soup tomorrow. Jeff, he bought it. Dot, dot. I'll meet you at Red Lobster in 15. The guy you are cheating on me with takes you to Red Lobster? I can't compete with that. Let's break up. <laughs> He's like, that is all types of fancy. Like, I'm not even mad. Like, you go on and be with your Red Lobster. Oh my God, Julian, that was a mistake. You shouldn't be cheating. Either you date... Julian or you date Jeff pick one you don't get two because now you're gonna end up having zero Like seriously, I still have bruises all over my arm. I got bruises. I got bruises everywhere Oh, those were playful punches, baby I didn't like the dress you bought and you literally beat the shit out of me. There was nothing playful about it Um, I guess you should never tell a girl that you don't like her outfit cuz uh, I'm scared <laughs> Hey, I know you've been super busy with your PlayStation 4, so I donated it to charity so we can spend more time together. Melissa, that's my stuff. What the heck is wrong with you? Okay, so I'm not more important than a machine? FIFA just came out. The machine is more important, of course. Oh man, this sucks. All his save files, gone. Everything gone. How you gonna, I mean, at least, at least she didn't like, throw it away at least she donated to charity but still i would be hella pissed i had the biggest fight with my boss why what happened he didn't give me the big project at work why not he's jealous because i'm pretty obviously i'm gonna stop you right there mary 
I'm sure you're very pretty, but I've never, ever, ever, ever heard about a boss not giving somebody a project because they were jealous of their prettiness. That sounds very unprofessional. I don't think somebody could make it to, to boss level being that unprofessional, but I don't know. That's just my opinion. Did you send poop to my house? Sorry, I was really upset with you. <laughs> you sent poop to his house? I First of all, the whole process of setting that up, <clears throat> disgusting. Like you must have been really upset. What could somebody have done that you wanted to put yourself through the disgustingness of putting poop in a bag and delivering it to someone's house? Like I ate your ice cream. It's not a big deal. Girl, you're gonna do this over ice cream? I will personally buy you ice cream. So you stop sending poop to people's houses. Like, no, I'm being serious. Hit me up in the comments. I will send you ice cream. <laughs> Nobody eats my ice cream. Don't test me, boy. Okay, you know what? Actually, I take it back. I don't even want to mess with this girl. You know, I, I, I want to stay far, far away. <laughs> Babe, I think I broke my hand at work. Stephanie's taking me to the ER. Who the F is Stephanie? Isn't even worried about his her, his hand. She's like, I don't even care what happened to your hand. I don't care if it hurts. But who is Stephanie and why is she taking you to work? Stephanie better be a man or or we're going to have a problem. Baby, I want you to know that I trust you so much. When you told me last night that you were hanging out with your friends, I followed you in love. I followed you and you actually did what you said. I love you. I have the best boyfriend ever so you stalked me yeah sorry to break it to you but like your girlfriend stalked you like she let you you went out with your friends and she followed you and probably had binoculars and was like what's going on over there you know like low-key like lip reading like okay this is what he's saying yeah yeah that I'm, that's how i envisioned it she's like no baby i was just checking up on you with binoculars we need to talk yeah, you guys need to talk because... <laughs> hey, I'm awake. Hello? Are you kidding me? You never make time for me. You are impossible. I was in the bathroom for three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes. You know, I didn't bring my phone in there. I just wanted to enjoy my poopy. Okay, my poopy did snoopy. And you were, you were just blowing up my phone. You need to relax. I, I just need I need three minutes of alone time. Is that too much for me to ask? It, I'm bored. Give me attention. I'm a little busy with this midterm studying. I hope you're happy then. I was putting school before me. So selfish. I, I'm pretty sure you're the one being selfish. Pretty sure you're the one being selfish. By the way, guys, I also did a worst boyfriend text video too. So it's like this, but like the opposite. So the boys are being mean. So yeah, if you want to check that out, I'll try to remember to leave the link in the description. But every time I say I'm going to leave a link in the description, I usually forget. So um, I'm sorry, but I'm going to try. I'm getting a fourth kitty. He's so cute. Matt, no, four is too much. The whole house smells like cat. If you don't appreciate them, then you can move out. I pay the entire rent. Girl, it's true. Like, if you're not contributing and you're not paying the rent, then you don't get to say what type of pets you get to keep at home. This is why it's... it's I, I believe in, like, equality. You know, I always split everything evenly with my boyfriend. Like, you know, we don't, like, necessarily split bills at restaurants, but we'll take turns. So it's like, one day he'll pay, one day I'll pay, one day... Because it just sometimes it's just so awkward to ask for them to split the bill. But I think that's like totally fair. Because then you get like, if you're e equally splitting stuff, you kind of get an equal say in everything. You know what I'm saying? Like this situation, if she was paying half the rent, then she gets equal say to how many cats they get to have. Me or your grandma? You aren't going to make me choose between you and my grandma. Choose! She's in the hospital. Of course I'm going to visit her. Goodbye then. Holy, I didn't know people could be this messed up. Like, you're real. You are making him choose between seeing you or seeing his grandmother who is sick in the hospital. Who raised you?
Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I love you all so much. Stay awesome, stay sweet, and don't forget to be nice to each other. Bye-bye. <laughs>